So in the sales game, an advantage you can have is to be naturally extroverted, okay? Some people naturally want to talk to other people, get in front of other people, and be the, let's say, uh, focus of a party, for example, right? Some people like that. That's what they're that's what they're into. That's what they feel comfortable with. Most of us are naturally introverted. We don't feel comfortable of getting in the front of the room and speaking to a bunch of people or being the first person who starts the conversation or they're very awkward when you're in an elevator and you don't really know what to say, right? So I was this way up until a few years back. I was not naturally extroverted. I had to work on this. I've talked about this before. I've given you drills or um, actions you can take to break through this fear. And now I'm gonna give you guys another set of drills or another action you can take to do the same. This is very, very important. Step one to be good at sales is to be able to talk to people. If you can talk to people, you will win. So if you're someone as interested as I am in being able to understand people and talk to any person, whether they be in a bad mood or a good mood or, you know, uh, looking like they're just going through uh, a mundane lifestyle, so kind of bored looking. um, If you're interested in that as I am, you're going to understand this drill and you're going to understand how it might help you. If not, and you're not really interested, you're going to say, why the hell in the world would I do that, right? Because it seems very uncomfortable, but I'm going to give it to you right now. So I had done a drill recently, right? I had done a drill recently where I made up a survey of three to five questions and I would walk around and I'd talk to these people. I'd go up to these people and ask them these three to five questions, no matter what their face looked like before I approached them. A lot of the times they looked pissed off. And when I went up to them and started talking to them, because of the survey, maybe because of the survey, maybe because how it looked, I don't freaking know. They were interested and happy to talk to me, right? So this kind of gets rid of the fear of the unknown because it's unknown. A lot of people are scared to approach someone else because they don't know how they'll they'll react. So try this, ask people, go up to people, three to five, uh, ask people three to five questions. Say, I have a survey. I would like you to answer. It's for whatever.